Welcome back everybody, it is Rudy with Alpha Investments, and we must be very cautious whenever handling extremely rare booster boxes. We must always use the proper equipment, the correct tools, and of course, high performance technology when handling these. So we're gonna get, let everybody know and teach everyone how to get involved with opening booster boxes properly. So this is the character, it has a little friend. That's all you need to know. Now when you open a box, always use the diamond cut pattern similar to cross stitching you must use diamond cut patterns for good luck people ask me all the time rudy explain to me how are your boxes lucky will you just explain to me look the boxes are lucky because i use the diamond cut pattern it really is that simple i mean i don't know what else you guys are looking for i mean that's all there is to life all right oh i don't know about that well nonetheless these boxes belong to my patron, Jesse. Jesse, good luck, and uh, may you have all packs of Shocklands. That's what I'm hoping for. That's a, not a good start. That's just a dollar rare that nobody's going to remember in 60 days from now. Congratulations, you have lost your first batch of money from the first booster pack. And Cinder Vines. There's a nice, what, $2 rare? A little $2 rare? Come on. Are we? I don't, I don't know if you're going to top the other patron from the other day, but we're going to try. Unbreakable garbage. Wow. Can we, uh, we are on the hot streak of we want to collect $1 bill booster packs. That's what we're going for today, boys and girls. So no rare pack. You hear that right, folks. Remember, all booster packs moving forward. When we get a split card, meld card, weak depth, diagonal crazy card, doesn't matter. We are acknowledging it as a non rare pack moving forward. $2 spirit. Wow. Are, so, Jesse, I appreciate you being a patron, but are you allergic to good cards? Are you, like, do you have allergy attacks to... Oh, $8 Judith in the face. Well, maybe you're not allergic to good cards. Maybe you just like to play the cautious, slow, dramatic game. Okay. Ah! So, you know, i buy you a taco. Crunchy? Hard shell? Well, Kaya has joined us today. So we got we just pulled an eight dollar Judith, and we got a nice ten dollar Kaya. So we went from nothing good, and I was making fun of my patron for collecting bad cards, to actually doing pretty good. And our first foil, Rakdos Trumpeteer, a completely hundred percent forgettable card that you are not going to remember or care about in ten seconds. All right, here we go. Boop, boop, boop. And pro oh my God, really? Are you, did, are you just showing off at this point? $15 Prime Speaker with a $10 Kaya with an $8 Judith still at zero shock lands. Man, these... I can definitely see how these boxes are going to hold value because that is a dice dollar rare that nobody cares. So, let's see if we can double your money from $79 a box to $159 per box. That's what we're going for today, everybody. Trying to see if a patron cannot lose all of his money on Timmy's investments live across the world. First shock land, the godless shrine, everybody. We're going to use shock lands as our pile in the middle there. So, well, um, only a third of the way through the box, and uh, this is a hell of a start, everybody. Not even going to lie. Growth Chamber $5 bill. Another one of the good mid range $5 rares. <coughs> okay. Not bad at all. <coughs> Woo! And Priest of Good Looking Lily for $2 and a foil zeal. Nobody cares. Hmm. I, I still think... I have a funny feeling this could be a home run box. We're on track. It is... Uh, we're actually hitting it pretty good. And Titty Taker. Well, Titty Taker is only a $2 card. Unfortunately, that's not going to get us to the home run box. It's just not going to get us there. And uh, Zigana, Utopian Speaker, not going to get us to heavy hitting land. That would be the RV of Hosetown. First class, no extra charge for the upgrade. Tomb of Beautiful Artwork and no money. It's one of those, it reminds me of those books that look really cool, but just has no value to it. You know what I'm saying? You, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? All right, Deputy of $2 worth of detention. Makes you wonder... By the way, I haven't said it yet. Um, Sphinx of $2. And, oh, I thought that was a foil rare. Geyer Engineer looking flashy over there. Uncommon foil. Remind everybody, today is, I think, what's today? Tuesday. And um, about three, four days after pre-release, Hollowed Fountain. 
And oh my god, what a pack. What a left and middle, which just melded into a third testicle. Second shock land, our foil rare is an incubation druid. Fantastic foil rare. One of the better foil rares in the set. So yeah, just so everybody knows, today is Tuesday, whatever that is. We're at four days after the pre-release weekend. And a no rare booster pack. So yeah, so keep in mind everything I'm quoting is based on technically week zero prices still. And emergency powers. Wow. Crappy couple dollar mythic. Swinging our first miss. And a wrecking ball from Miley somebody. Okay. Uh, are we losing steam? Are we, no, we're doing okay. No, we're, no, no, we still got this. We still got this. And theater of horrors. Great artwork. And that's about all you're left with. Just nice artwork. So two thirds of the box. And no rare pack. All right, and uh, last one-third of the chunk of the box. Moving in right now, everybody. Here we go. And lumbering, no uh, dollar rare. Dollar rare, everybody. Dollar rare. Hmm, not going to get as far. Guardian, pro God, Lee, hello. Are we are really stalling out now? Come on, come on, everybody. Where's the action? Man. And, okay, Sargon's Hellkite. There he is. He returns again. Fourth Mythic of the box. So $10, $15, and about a 10 So $15, $25, $35. So about $40 bucks worth of Mythics. So this $80 booster box that my patron purchased, about half the value right there is just in those couple Mythics. That's not bad. Glass with the Guild Pack. Throw in two $10 Shocklands. Are they still $10? Maybe $8 now. So not bad. Okay, not bad at all. And no rare pack with a foil blade brand. Ooh, that's neat looking artwork for a common foil. So 40 bucks worth of mythics. I'd say we're looking at about yeah, 15 worth of shock lands. Mass manipulation, nice little dollar card. And I'd say about 15, 20 bucks for the rare. So I'd say we're probably what 60. I'd say we're probably about 90 bucks right now. Not bad for an eight dollar box. Ooh, revise that to a hundred dollars. Third shock land of the box. We're at a hundred dollar booster box right now. Not doing so bad. Yeah, not, uh, not doing so bad. Oh God! Woo! Okay, four shock lands in the box. Back now we're bumping up to one ten. Wow! Talk about uh, boy, that's how fast your luck changes in this city, everybody. And absorb, nice little two dollar rare. So yeah, we're sitting about uh, we're about what one ten for this box right now. Doing quite well actually, quite well. And the dollar circle, nobody cares. And what do we got? Uh, we're down to the last two packs of box one. Seems like all these boxes... Ooh, $3... Coffee? Cafe? Frappe latte? Reach around coffee? So I would say we're averaging. I don't think we've really opened any really bad booster, uh, booster boxes so far. Um, no rare pack and a foil storm strike. So that wraps up box one. We're going to get right into box two. No diamond cut pattern. We're going to do a single cut. See if the luck is still there with Lady Luck. All right, so box two already. Uh, box one, eight out of ten, nine out of ten range, solid. $110 box. You pay 80 bucks, can't complain. Not really a home run like a foil mythic or crazy shockland foil, but you know what? Still a good hit. Can't complain at all, everybody. Pack one, couple dollar, Lavinia, Lavinia, Lavinia? Oh, hold on, let me move my comments, because my, my hairy arm always wants to just wreck the common pile. Please hold. Ba, na, 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 Okay, okay, here we go. Moving on. We got this, we got it. We got this, boys and girls. You ready? And Sargon's Hellkite. $10 Mythic Duplicate right off the bat. Okay, okay. That seems like fun. And wow. Oh, thank God. Are you serious right now? Pack two. Another Shockland. Holy smokes. Whoa. Whoa. Um, pack three. Okay. And no rare pack with a spike wheel acrobat. Pretty cool. Wow. Talk about. Dude, this is already getting nuts. I generally think we could be. If we can stay with the duplicates, we could be... We've already got a duplicate Shockland and a $10 duplicate Mythic. That's a really good sign for box two. And as we all know, duplication has been absolutely ridiculous 
in this 250 card set. So whatever the reason may be with that, duplication seems to be holding very high. No rare pack. Nobody cares. And hashtag no rare pack. Hate those split cards. I have bad dreams about that junk. I'm telling you guys. Amplifier. Cool artwork. Fun card. No value. Nobody cares. As they say in Wall Street, completely and utterly forgettable. Cinder Vines. Four or five dollars. Cinder Vines. Not a bad little rare. Hey, remember, when you're paying $2.23 a pack, I think it is. Hey, five dollar card's a great hit for a two dollar pack. And Utopian Speaker, again, duplicate there. So remember that. Well, remember, the cost of these packs is $2.25. So keep that in mind when we're quoting these numbers, everybody. It's not Ultimate Masters crazy level. We don't need, you know, fifty hundred dollar cards because we don't have a high break even. We don't have a high bar to jump over. Growth Chamber Guardian, four or five dollar rare. Okay. Because the key in all these, you want a lot of those mid-range rares to break even on the bad packs and kind of bump your head slowly. And uh, skewer, that is a cool looking common though. Skewer the critics, I like that. It's like throwing a candelabra dagger. But so we want to at least get a few bucks along the way and then get those big heavy hitters to really push us through the, the home stretch. Mirror match, that is not going to do it. So that is always the goal of this stuff. And all right, here we go. Boop, boop, boop. And Unbreakable Formation. I think we get that card in every box. And the Uncommon Shaman of Rudy. Look at that dude. What is he doing? What is he doing? Nobody has a flipping clue. What is that crazy little dude doing? All right. High Alert Rat Spirit and Gutter Bones with a foil. We're getting a lot of foils. Titanic Brawl. Just a common. Just a common. We're definitely pulling a lot of foils in the packs. Definitely feels that way. All right, and deputy of $2 bill. I miss $2 bills. You know, you take a chick on a date, whip out that $2 bill, and she goes, oh, my. Indeed, Rudy. Oh, indeed. Oh, Kaya again. Duplicate city. We're back. Two Sargon's dragons and a double Kaya. We're coming right back to duplicate land. Wow. Okay, so two of our mythics are now duplicates. And, pro oh, my God. God! Are you guys serious? Bill! Where are the bobs? Get the bobs in here! Oh my god. So two Kayas, two Sargons, Halkai, now a double prime. Oh my god. Astonishing. Absolutely astonishing. And Guardian Project. What are the odds of hitting like the three most expensive mythics in both boxes in a row? And now on this box, what do we only have? I think we're only, what, two Shocklands? So if we can go up on the Shocklands, up, oh, there's our Foil Rare. Oh, there goes our chance for Foil Mythic. Or Theater of Horrors. Looks pretty sweet, though, but no real value. Man, if we can hit, I think we're at only, what are, I think we're only one. Are we only one Shockland? Are you serious? I thought we had two. Oh, we're only one Shockland? That's not good. Uh, that's the same one, isn't it? Is that the same one? It is the same one. All the mythics are the same again. God. Okay. Um, mass manipulations. God, the duplications are nuts on this. Watchful giant. That's a cool little common foil. So all four mythics are duplicates. Based on that, the only mythic... Wait a minute. Do we have a fifth mythic? No, the first box, we had four Mythics. The second box, we had the exact same four Mythics. Holy crap. Absolutely zero, zero, what? I can't even talk. Zero variants. And a Screaming Rudy Shield. Ah! And, of course, Spirit. Ah! Okay, sorry. Sorry. Life is too short to not have fun. Well, I guess that's all the Mythics, because we got four. And same, same Carl, same... Oh my god. I think every video I've been talking about on this Ravnica's the duplication on this stuff is nuts. Whoa, hold on. That is a beautiful artwork. Absolutely gorgeous caretaker. Love it. Godless Shrine. At least we finally got our second Shockland. So, alright. Are we going to get the same Shocklands in both boxes? We could. That might happen. And a Prognitive Perception. We actually did not get that rare. In the other box. I actually know that for a fact. I would have recognized that. Alright. Here we go. Here we go. And Plaza. We did get that in the other box. That is a duplicate. I know that for a fact. 
Alright. Ah, here we go. And smothering titties. Alright. Smothering titties, everybody. Smothering the titties. That's actually like a $3 rare. It's actually not that bad. It's actually a new, unique little ability. And a glass of the guild pig. Guild pig. Guild gate. I should learn to speak English. All right, here we go. Here we go. All right, boop, boop, boop. And Simic Ascendancy and a foil, really cool foil though. Sphinx is inside, that's a neat foil. Look at that bad boy. No value, but it was worth the eye candy, wasn't it? All right, here we go. And Hallowed Fountain, that's the same one. All right, three duplicate Shocklands and all duplicate Mythics. Really? Okay. And the Reveler? Uh, I think it's $2, but I don't think we got the Reveler in the other box. I think the, the four same Mythics in both boxes though, was a little... And I know we got the book, because I was just talking about how much I like the artwork on the book like five minutes ago. So I know that was in the first box. Ridiculous. And Theater of Horrors. I know we got that. I remember talking about that. Well, last two packs. And, uh, well... All the Mythics are the same, and all the Shockland. Angel of Grace, we got a fifth Mythic. The fifth, another $14 Mythic. Holy crap. So this is what it feels like if you buy two boxes from Creepy Rudy for $79 each, and then you double it. And old ways, no value. Wow. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Absolutely astonishing. So yeah, we only got, so we're only looking at three Shocklands. But five mythics and all the expensive ones. Well, I appreciate it, Jesse. Congratulations, sir.